Ty, these are some insanely huge <laughs> bones. But yeah. so, what do we got here? Well, what we have is a right, hadrosaur ischium, and we have a big triceratops rib. And what we want to talk about, what we want to show you guys, was uh, this should kind of shows both river sorting and flow direction. So, look. If you look, they're about the same size, about the same shape, and they've stacked up together because as the river was washing down, they were just the right size and shape that they just kept stacking up in this position, in this spot right here. All these digs we've been doing, the direction of the flow seems to be going about like this. So what happens is you'll get these big bones, you'll get a big bone or something like this log jam, and then you'll get all these small pieces that wash up against it. Now that you know the direction of water flow, can that help you find more things? It does. What it does is it helps us a lot as we're digging bones to know where to really watch a lot closer for like teeth and things like that. So when you get a big bone or a big lump or something, you know, that you're digging on, the upstream side is going to have the heavier teeth and the nuggets of bone and things like that washed up against it and stacked up. Backside will have stuff right against it, but you usually can go through it fairly quick. Where the upwater side, you can have things stacked up for four, five, ten feet in a big triangle coming off it. That's awesome! Ah, that's so cool, dude. All right, well, we still got a lot more digging. Yeah, there's a lot of digging.